You've probably heard the term HD2D before, but do you really know what it means? When Square Enix partnered up with Acquire Corp to work on Octopath Traveler, they set out to combine the nostalgic pixel art of Super Nintendo games with modern lighting and post-processing technology of Unreal Engine 4. Shortly after the game was released, they filed a trademark for the term HD2D. However, this doesn't prevent you from making games in this art style. You're just not allowed to use the term HD2D in your marketing. Square Enix then went on to publish many more games with this art style over the years, all of them being made in Unreal Engine 4. Dragon Quest 3 HD 2D Remake is currently in development and will be the first one to use Unreal Engine 5. There are also a few indie developers making use of a similar art style. An example is the game Sacrifier by Pixelated Milk, which is set to release in 2023. I'm currently also working on a side-scrolling beat-em-up in this art style and have many Unreal Engine tutorials that can teach you how to make a 2D 3D hybrid game like this. If you like this type of content, please subscribe and check out my devlog series in the pinned comment.